Hello everybody, I'm Jackie K. Cooper and my entertainment rundown for today is a review of the streaming series The Crown and this is season five and we're still looking at the life of Queen Elizabeth at this point. She's gotten older and she's played by Imelda Staunton. Uh, Prince Philip is played by Jonathan Price. Charles is played by Dominic Cooper. Uh, Princess Margaret is played by Leslie Manville, and Princess Diana is played by Elizabeth DeBicke. And of those, DeBicke is just amazing as Diana. She, she looks so much like her, and she holds her head in the same way Diana did, and she, she, she moves her hands. It, it's just a great performance. And all of the performances are good in this. It's just that this focuses on Charles and Diana's marriage, just you know, going from bad to worse, you know, his involvement with Camilla Parker Bowles, uh, that's all involved. It also focuses, it starts and, and ends the season with the uh, British yacht, the Britannia. Britannia. And they need to have it refurbished, and the government says, well, the taxpayers shouldn't have to pay to have it refurbished. And they tell, it looks like, you know, oh, but it's, you know, it's the royal yacht and it's tradition, so it should be repaired, and the royal family shouldn't be expected to pay for everything. But that almost becomes a symbolism of the monarchy. Does, you know, Britain really want to hold on to a monarchy? You know, is, is it out of date? And then inside, Charles is thinking, why doesn't my mother, you know, step down from the throne and let me be king and become a more modern king? So you have these sweeping moments within it, you know, played against the background of, of the disillusion of Charles and Diana's marriage. The acting is great. It just seems that here in the fifth season that it's, it, not dynamic enough. Even with this great performance by Elizabeth Debicki, she's terrific. It's a little bit of too much of the same old, same old, and you feel like you're you're just stretching it out for eight to ten episodes, however many there are. But I'm sure if you're a fan of The Crown, you're going to want to see season five. You're going to want to see these excellent performances. You you know realize it's based on you know, certain facts, but they take liberties uh, in, in you know, presenting the story. So I think they, they, the creators have said this is not a documentary. This is a, a movie based on you know, certain facts. So keep that, keep that in mind. Not everything you see is 100% accurate. But this has been Jackie K. Cooper's Entertainment Rundown with a review of The Crown season five.